when it comes to question. As the first one comes from Adam Lai. How many shirts can I wash in the 10 kilogram washing machine? Great shirt. Uh, great uh, question, Adam. Yeah. So, of course, we like to be able to um, wash as many uh, shirts as possible. And, of course, in a 10 kilogram washing machine, yeah. you'd actually be able to fit 50 shirts in there. So that means you'd be able to do, well, I'm sure you've got a lovely selection of shirts at home. I'm very slick. I'm very slim. Like if it's 50 is the average, uh, I would go 50, 65 or something. Well, like I'm that. sure you're always working away with work and what have you. And, of course, when you come home, you want to be able to do everything at once. Rather than having lots yeah. and lots of washing cycles and having to come back and forth, you're going to be able to do everything in one go. But once again, you said like 50? 50 shirts, yes. It's 50, five shirts. Five zero. Yes, shirts. five shirts per kilo. Per kilo? Mm. 50 per kilo? No. No, 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 no. Five see, shirts see, per kilo. Five, five shirts per kilo. And of course, kilo. in a 10 kilo machine, like what we're arranging uh, here, we're going to do 10 kilo, 8 kilo, and all the different spin sizes. Okay, so as usually well. uh, that will be 40 shirts for this washing machine, which is because it indicates eight, 8 kilograms. This one is an 8 kilogram washing machine. See, yes. for me, this is a totally new transfer in my, in, my, in my head, just like learning about that. Five. Is that a general quote or is it just like a quote that, that uh, happens to be factual for Panasonic washing machines? It's factual for Panasonic, but it is a generalization as well. One kilo, five T-shirts. That's correct. Okay, so Adam and I, there's your answer. And I hope, of course, that they will smell very good after the wash.